Hello everybody, boys, girls, ladies, gentlemen, dudes and uh, dudettes. This is Sergey Baklikov, 16th of July 2020. I can continue my uh, road trip now through the Republic of Karelia. Yesterday I was in Petrozavodsk and today I came to Kinerma, Kinerma village, which is in about like 50, 60 kilometers from Petrozavodsk. And you know, this village is officially in the list of uh, the most beautiful villages of Russia. Let's explore it right now together. Kinerma. The first mention in a chronicles, this is official chronicles, was in 1496. So the village is already uh, older than uh, 500 years, five centuries here. And I can say that I was absolutely, really absolutely amazed with this village because, you know, here is... Uh, no any influence of uh, the new styles. This is pretty authentic village. Only 15 yards, 15 houses here now. But uh, back in the Soviet days, here used to be uh, like up to 180 residents in a whole village. Because here was in the Soviet days, the collective farm. But then that collective farm was closed and uh, people just lost their job and started going away from here. Now, here is uh, all year long living only five people. Five people in a whole village. Well, of course, like in a summertime, way more, way more people are living here. Uh, the inheritance of uh, uh, the original, the original families, the original people who lived here and now they mostly consider this as the summer houses. But uh, here is no any new constructions and uh, here is no any new uh, buildings which is out of, uh, out of the style, out of the original Karelian style of the village. The bus stop. It's pretty beautiful, pretty beautiful. And everything is so authentic here. The village right in the middle of uh, the woods, Karelian woods. I've fallen in love with Karelia. Karelia, you know, now in my head, it's just unstoppable. Uh, woods everywhere, the lakes and Ivan T. You see those flowers? This is Ivan T. Wow. Only 15 houses now here. Look, this is a uh, typical Karelian fence, which is made like this. There is a chapel, the chapel of uh, the Smolensk Mother of God. And this is the oldest house, older than 260 years. Uh, there is now living Yegorov. That's the house of Yegorov family. We can get inside of this house and we can see how it is inside. Let's do this. Getting inside. Whoa, it's warm here. The stove. 
the warmest place on a stove. Except the fridge, here is everything so authentic. The red corner, by the way, I have found how it's called, the red corner, the corner with an icon. The red, krasny, it's in uh, the old Russian language means like beautiful, beautiful corner. so authentic and you know this is actually now it's a uh, guest house now they give this house uh, for rent Now, let's get inside of the chapel. A small chapel. As I told you, the chapel of uh, the Smolensk Mother of God. And here is the house of Yegorov family. You see the uh, carrels used the foundation with uh, just a uh, stones and that's why under the weight of uh, the construction of the house you often can meet uh, the house which uh, has a different level Now let's get back to the village and see all the houses here. Authentic Karelian architecture wooden architecture and artists are getting inspired with a beauty of uh, Kinerma village However, some modern attributes presents here as well. 
people have the uh, satellite television and satellite internet. The bathhouse on the background. And that's the house of the family that living here already for more than 200 years and living here all the year long. Wow, look at this. Zeal. Cool. Cool, so cool. They grow up here, everything what is possible to grow up in this location, in this climate zone. The summer here is not that long, it's not that long, but it's enough to grow up many different vegetables. It's cool. It's cool. If you was looking for something real, authentic, come to Kinerma. This is a big time village. Wow, 
just wow. Now here in the end we are invited in the house of the family which is like the main family here now in this village for a tea drinking. They are living here on a regular basis already for more than 200 years. Everything what is here on a table grown up and made by this family. That's what I've got. This is so called kalitka. It's a bread and a porridge, like all together. Then here goes the traditional dessert, Korean dessert. It's a cake with the berries. And here is blin. It's like a pancake. All the same stuff, but just it's, it doesn't have round form. Now, this was definitely an awesome experience. Kinerma village, the Republic of Karelia. Stay tuned and keep watching. If you enjoyed this, don't forget like, comments, and subscribe to my channel if you're not yet. See you.